So here we are. I have finally unwrapped the full hive from Legacy Apiaries in Indiana made of western red cedar. So I'm, I think I have it assembled correctly. So we'll do a quick run through here of what the hive looks like again. The cover, which I've already shown in a previous video, but just in case you didn't watch that one, we'll have another look. Very nice, very high quality. And we have here an inner cover. And apologies if it's a little video. I don't have a tripod with me. I forgot to bring it to the farm. And I don't have anyone here to hold the camera, which is just as well because most folks I have who held the camera are shakier than me. So the inner cover. And then we have five medium frames. I'm sorry, five medium boxes. And uh, you can see from the inside down to the bottom, very nice, very well made. I'm impressed. I have no basis for comparison since this is my first experience with beekeeping, but I wanted to start with what I think is quality based on reviews and descriptions. And I am very pleased with my purchase at this point. So we'll remove these just to kind of show specific boxes. And you will see there we have high quality screws. And we have, they're just attached. Smells nice. And the bottom board stand I have ordered. A special screened bottom board with Freeman Beetle Trap, I think that's what it's called, from CountryRubes.com, which I will have more information on that as soon as those come in. More expensive than the typical screen bottom boards with Beetle Traps, but again, I wanted to go for quality, and I got really great reviews from that, so we will close this one out. I guess if I have a complaint at all, it's a volume of plastic wrapping around each piece. Uh, I understand the purpose for that. Had they not wrapped it, someone would complain that it wasn't packed carefully. But with all that paper and all the plastic wrap, um, I worked up a sweat just getting this um, unwrapped. And uh, in any event, I hope you enjoyed this unboxing series and I will um, be back with more information once I have my bees, which I'm hoping will be this week. Um, don't know absolutely for sure, but that was the original plan. I haven't heard anything in about a week, so I'm not sure if they're quite ready yet. Um, more as soon as I have more to report. Take care. Cherie from Shine Springs Farm.